on display are also a genuine leaf and a facsimile reproduction of the 1762 Paris edition of the King James Bible. It's the first edition, first printing prepared by Dr. F.S. Paris of Sydney Sussex College in Cambridge. Following the 1755 publication of Samuel Johnson's Dictionary, the first English dictionary, this edition of the King James was the first with standardized spelling. In this Bible, a serious attempt was made to correct the text of the King James Version by amending the spelling and punctuation, unifying and extending the use of italics, and removing printing errors. The folio edition is so rare that only six copies are known to exist today. The purification process continued from the 1762 Paris edition to this next edition of the King James Bible. On exhibit are an actual leaf and a facsimile reproduction of the 1769 Oxford edition of the authorized version of 1611. The editor, Dr. Benjamin Blaney, used Samuel Johnson's 1755, a dictionary of the English language to standardize the spelling, capitalization, punctuation, and grammar of the authorized versions. Its renderings continue to give the preeminence to the Lord Jesus Christ and its readings represent the doctrines of the historic Christian faith. The form of the words, format of the text, and other refinements of this 1769 edition became the foundation for future printings of the King James Bible. The genuine facing pages are from a rare first printing of the 1769 Oxford edition, which includes passages from Acts 11.28 through 15.4. These chapters record important Christian truths. The first Bible teachers and missionaries were from Antioch. Paul preached the death, burial, and resurrection of Jesus Christ. The Jews rejected the gospel, which opened the door of faith for the Gentiles. The word of the Lord was published throughout all the region. The published word of God is just as important today as it was in Paul's day. Whether you are looking for a saving faith in Jesus Christ or a living faith through him, it can be found within the pages of our English Bible.